Um, I guess it's a pretty common injury, and uh, I guess it's just it's one of those things that just happened. You know, I've been uh, gained a few pounds since the end of last season, so I think that has something to do with it because I got a stress fracture in my shin one time at UCLA the same way. So um, I'm guessing that's what happened. Uh, how, did, how exactly did this, this injury come about? Situation where you just, uh, uh, just it just slowly started hurting, and you know everybody got um, you know little pains, and I thought it was gonna go away, so it didn't. And I was playing on it about two weeks, and then when I got to sack, um, I got an X-ray the next morning, and then they told me later on the day. It just felt sore at first, and then that's when you kind of uh, yeah, yeah. So how long ago was that? Was that about uh, close, close to that. It, that it happened. That it started hurting. That it started hurting. Probably uh, two weeks before I got examined. So how's the progress on it been? It's good. I don't got any pain. Um, I mean, I just did some treadmill work today, and um, you know, I can get some shooting up and stuff and running up and down. They just don't want any, you know, contact because it's not fully healed yet. Do you have any idea when? Um, you might be able to get back on the court and start doing some full contact drills? Um, I would hope you know, no, no longer than another two weeks at least.